Hey friends, welcome to One Little Coder. In this tutorial, we are going to learn about a very interesting feature of DALI 2. If you are not familiar with DALI 2, DALI 2 is this open AIS model, the giant model, where you just have to give some prompt in English, natural language, and it is going to create relevant pictures like what DALI 2 understands from this text and DALI 2 is going to generate that picture. So until now, most people I have known have been using DALI 2 to generate pictures. You give a prompt like this high quality photo of beautiful sunset, blah, 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 blah. And DALI 2 is going to generate equivalent picture. But what I recently learned is DALI 2 has got a very nice tip that a lot of people are not using it. And that can actually make a huge impact in fashion industry or in fact, even stock photography. So what is that feature? So I'm going to show you what is that feature. Um, but before that, I'm going to describe you first. Let's say this is this is Anna Hathaway. I think um, Anne Hathaway, Anna Hathaway, I don't know, Anne Hathaway. Okay. So we're going to take this picture of Anne Hathaway and then we're going to see, you know what, instead of this particular outfit, how would it look if Anne Hathaway wears a leather jacket? So that's what first we are going to see. Okay. If this is what you want in a typical advertisement industry, you have to hire Anne Hathaway you have to um, ask Anne Hathaway to wear that particular jacket. You have to probably ship it. You have to then take a picture. It, it, you know, this is a huge process in the industry, which is what currently happens. But what I am going to suggest to you is you can use Dali 2 and then see how the outfit is going to look on Anne Hathaway without having to try out the outfit actually. And that the result is really impressive. Like the whole reason I'm making this video is because the result is impressive. How to do that? First, go to the DALI2 image, um, DALI2 interface right now, what you've got. You've got a button called upload here, the upload feature, click the button. And once you click it, it's going to ask you to select a picture. So I'm going to select the Anne Hathaway's picture and I'm going to select like the part of the video, uh, sorry, part of the picture. I'm going to click done. Once I click done, it's going to give me two options, images, edit image, generate variations. When I click generate variations, it's going to give different images that look like this. So DALI 2 would ultimately end up creating different versions of Anne Hathaway, like, like different human beings. But what we want is we want to actually use this image, but we want to edit it. So I'm going to click edit image and then this is the interface that you get. So now you have to first select what is a part of the image that you want to edit. So we want to edit this. So I'm going to select what we want to edit, right? After I select what we want to edit, now I'm going to go here and then give a prompt. So the text that you give to DALI2 for DALI2 to make a decision or DALI2 to process and then create an image is what we call as a prompt in this case. So we're going to give DALI2 a prompt. So what is a prompt? I'm going to say just simply wearing a leather jacket and I'm going to click generate and then see what happens. So typically it would take a couple of seconds uh, and I'm not editing this video so you can actually see how much time it takes so you can see that the image that we have selected and then the mask that we applied like the section where we told DALI 2 that we need this editing to happen and also of course the the prompt the text saying we are in a leather lab jacket is available so now what you can actually see is you can see impressive pictures of Anne Hathaway wearing leather jacket so you can see the kind of details that it has got like for example you can as you notice here this section is not even visible but DALI 2 has somehow managed to put put something there like I mean imagine like this 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 model um DALI 2 or this um AI whatever you know people call it it has not seen the skin but it, it has managed to put the skin that is coherent with the face and all these things and you can you can see you can see different variations you can see different variations of leather jacket and this is absolutely amazing like in fact like you've got nails maybe i don't know i don't know if it is perfect but you can see i think one thing dali 2 doesn't do very well is like when you have got um, fingers and all these things but for most part i would say this has done a very good job so instead of asking for a leather jacket let me say a red color gown i don't know if it is even a dress um, i'm i'm quite bad with um, fashion but let's see so okay i should have said wearing red color gown so let's see let's see if it is going to it's going to do something um let's see but the point here is you can take a picture 
and then you can edit this section a part of a picture and then you can basically make a human being wear something else other than what so you can see again like we have this this doesn't look very natural to me this doesn't look natural either so you can you can see because you have not defined the attributes of the dress very well so i can say wearing a uh, wearing dress let's see if it works out again um this is this is i'm just experimenting while this video is happening but the crux of this video is to introduce how you can use dali 2 and then make fashion choices uh, change outfits of somebody so after this i'm going to actually show you a cricket player how we are going to change the dress that the cricket player was wearing while um, the picture was shot so again so the original image you've got a wedding dress wedding dress um not 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 nice you can see that how terrible it looks in certain places but um i mean i don't know i don't know if this is actually a wedding dress but you can see that dali 2 is doing its job in trying to predict trying to uh, describe in the form of a picture of what you want so now as i said uh, we're going to leave and have the way this is this is done good so i'm going to upload a new picture upload i'm going to take a um, cricket player in this case kevin peterson okay i'm going to take kevin peterson um, kevin peterson was a very popular england player for some time now he is a commentator but um, yeah i'm going to take this picture i'm going to click edit image and i'm going to say what i want to edit i want to basically edit this i don't want to edit anything else so i'm going to say i'm going to say wearing a blue color indian uh, or wearing an indian flag color t-shirt okay let's see if it works out this is again like i said I'm just trying it while i'm recording this video i didn't i didn't do a lot of prep in this case I was just mind blown um, by seeing that this is even a possibility. I recently came across on Twitter somewhere um, where people have managed to do this thing. So I, I just wanted to get this word out to say how you can make somebody wear a different different um, dress altogether. So, so this is amazing, right? So this is Kevin Peterson. Kevin Peterson with a different... So one thing, again, Dali 2 doesn't do well is text. It messes up text a lot. But without anything, you can see... <laughs> Need to MDA. I don't know. Dali two. This is this doesn't look a little uh, perfect. Um, but but you can see changes happening. And uh, let's try with one final image where I wanted to actually show you uh, the entire um, process of doing it. One second. So you go to Dali two. Uh, you have an option to upload an image. Once you upload an image, you can select the image. And then like, for example, here, like, for example, this is another Indian actress, um, South Indian actress. So I can select a particular part and then I can say edit image and uh, I can select the necklace here. Right. And then I can say. Wearing a diamond necklace. And select generate. And uh, let's see if it is going to make some change there. So the current necklace, I don't know what was it, a current necklace, but we are expecting it to change to a different necklace altogether. And that is exactly what we are experimenting. If this turns out to be successful, then we would probably end this video here. So if you have got Dali 2 access, I would strongly recommend you to try out. Oh, it, it didn't generate anything. So I think the problem is because um, it is just one sided. I think that is that is the problem you can see that it it managed to it managed to remove it in all the pictures maybe one more variation we can try is um i can upload again um the same picture let me try let me try uh, yeah let let me let me try this edit done edit image select the part so you can select the part here what you want to do so now i can say now i can say wearing um blue color salwar kameez i don't know if the spelling is correct um hopefully dalito can 
decode what I'm trying to say, but let's see if it doesn't, if it doesn't, uh, if it doesn't recognize it, then, then, you know, it's, it's on, it's on me that I, I didn't, I didn't write the spelling properly, but the idea is to see if we can actually change the color or uh, the change the outfit itself so that, um, you can basically use Dali to, to, yeah, it, it works out, but I wouldn't say it has worked out really well. So th this one is something that I would say it has really worked out very well. So you can literally see the image has changed, but there are other images. I wouldn't necessarily say that it has worked out. This, this is fine, but you can also see some patches here, but overall the idea is you can take an image, upload the image and then make the image do something like you, you can edit the image and uh, that that actually produces now photorealistic images of the same person with a different outfit and i believe this is a very lesser known feature of dali 2 and if you have dali 2 access i would strongly encourage you to try out this and then let me know how it goes um, you can try out with celebrities you can try out with your own picture of something that you wanted to wear um try out with anything let me know how it goes otherwise um I, i'll select a very nice picture of what we got so um, you can see that this is this is something that we tried and we have got really you know good output using dali 2 just simply using natural language english in this case and then trying to change the outfit of a photo and uh, thanks to dali 2 and thanks to the access if you have uh, any feedback or thought um please let me know i would probably make few more tips around dali 2 and uh, looking forward to hear from you what you made Thank you so much. Stay safe. Happy coding. Peace.